Hey guys, welcome back, Jack Frost here. Today I'll be going over a tutorial on how to complete the Dragon Spiral quest. So once you've done the Mushu crafting quest, and by the way, I have all spiral crafting quests, well, other than Dragon Spire and beyond. I mean, after this video, obviously, Dragon Spire will be completed, but all other crafting quests before Dragon Spire are on my channel, so yeah. I must confess that your ability rivals my own, and now the student has become the master. I urge you to continue your journey. Dragonspire is where you will learn still greater secrets of crafting. If he still lives, Balthazar Dragonborn is the master artisan of Dragonspire. Seek him out and humbly request his teachings. Even in death I can find no rest. Who are you and what do you want? I have little time for apprentices, so unless you come highly recommended, you're out of luck. Toshio of Mushu sent you? Say nothing more. I respect his work. And his recommendations speaks louder than words. But still, I must see your work for myself. Craft for me two rings of apotheosis, and we will see if you've got what it takes to be nice to you. So obviously, first we're gonna buy the recipe from him. So the ring of Apotheos, however you say that. So bye. Now I will be over I will be going over the ingredients, so give me a moment. So obviously the first ingredient we need is ghost fire. We need nine of them. However, we're crafting two rings, so you're gonna get 18 ghost fire from this guy right here. Uh, Zolta Nightstone, and let's see, what was it? 19, 18? Yeah, 19. I mean 18. Yeah, 18. Um, shouldn't cost too much. 18. All right. Next, now I will be going over the um. Black Lotus. All right, the next obvious place for Black Lotus is um, um, the bazaar, obviously. Um, for me, yeah, just just wait to the, just wait in the bazaar. Black Lotus isn't really that hard to find. However, if you want to go hardcore, you can talk to the Mushu vendor, and he has a transmute recipe. We need you um use regions to create another region, and you need ten ore and ten cattail in order to create one Black Lotus. And um, ore in here can be found pretty easily. Um, there's turquoise, it's hard to find, or, yeah, or, bam, and cattail. Okay, cattail you can easily get in Marleybone near the, uh, Digimore station by changing realms over and over, it's always there, literally. But, um, did somebody take this already? Most likely. Yeah. Anyway, but, um, next region. Oh, yeah, and you can also, um, go to Mushu in the grassy areas around Hamist, not Hamistu Village, um, Village of Sorrow, and, uh, Asian burial grounds. Now the next one, I believe. What was it? Diamond? Oh uh, yeah, diamond. Alright, let's go over that. Alright, first of all, um, diamond can be found within the bazaar sometimes. Okay, wow, that's Slaughtered Blood Moss. I don't really see that many. Hold on. Wow. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Alright, um, diamond. Um, I see diamond regularly, like, every, um, every, like, two minutes or so. However, um, here's another way to get diamond. So, another good way to get diamond is to talk to this lady over here, the, the Marleybone Crafting Lady, whatever you want to call her. Um, go to Transmute, and she has a few here. Scrap Iron, Spring, Bronze, Skipper. I noticed there's a diamond. Now, ore is pretty easy to get. You can always, um, um the recipe costs 200, 200 gold, by the way. Um, you can always um, find ore in the bazaar. There's like 400 available. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it to it, so it's not that hard to get diamond. And, um, I think I already have enough, yeah, for the quest. And another good way to get diamond, yeah, bizarre transmute recipe. Oh, and by the way, in order to transmute, you will need a, uh, card crafting, qu card crafting station. I believe there's one in the, uh, Dragon Spiral, Dragon Spy, d yeah, Dragon Spire, uh, housing shop. Maybe the bazaar. I'm not sure about the Mushu. I know Mushu has an equipment crafting station, so yeah. And you will also need a, need a uh, equipment crafting station, which you can get in Mushu, in order to craft the rings or yeah, pretty much anything here in this category. So uh, yeah, so it's two of them. So one and two. All right, there we go. Uh, I met you guys were um Balthazar is <laughs> said his name right, I think. You certainly took your time, didn't you? I know an eternity when I see one. 
And that was an eternity. Let's have a look, shall we? Balthazar examines your rings, almost dismissively. As he goes, he smiles and seems less dismissive. Well, you've certainly got a few tricks up your sleeve. Not bad at all. Your work is impressive. I'll give you credit for that. But I can't judge it based on one sample. I need for you to make me two Thunder Shield quarks to demonstrate that you're not a one-trick pony. <laughs> you do want to show me what you're capable of, right? Bring them back to me when you're done. And don't be sloppy. No loose or crooked thread will get by me. For the recipe, you must go to Mushu and speak to Hua Yong. It can be found in Yoshihito Temple. Okay, first of all, this quest is different for, um, depending on what, um, school of magic you are. Now, I will only be doing the ice school, however, in the description, um, there is a link that will lead you to Duelist 101, and there's a crafting guide on there telling you, um, the recipes and how to get each region. Um, so yeah, that should be able to help. But yeah, um, meet you guys in Mushu. Alright, I don't know if it's the same vendor for, um, for ice. But, um, I mean for every other class, but yeah, for I just want to talk to this guy, and I love how he's like, um, talk to this person when he's been dead for hundreds of years, I think, so. I'm sure she's like, what, 30 years old? I don't know, anyway. <laughs> um, what was it again? Frost, what? It was a frost so I think. Um, oh, Thunder Chill, yeah, Thunder Chill. So it's this one right here. Okay, this is really easy, actually. All of this is really easy to get. So, um, alright, meet you guys in the bazaar. Alright, now we need, um, for the first, um, recipe, we need six no man cards, so, obviously the bizarre, that's, uh, self-explanatory, um, evil snowman, no, I clicked on the eyes, come on. So, yeah, right, you gotta be kidding me, there we go. So, six of them, right, how many? Okay, we went twelve, actually, because we're doing two of them, so twelve... Come on. There we go. Wow, 3,300. Okay, that's a lot. Um, Next region we want is uh, 14 Amethyst, which can be bought right here in the bazaar, I'm pretty sure. Okay, there's not a lot, so just go over here. Alright, it says we need 14, but multiply that by 2, that's 28. So, you want to talk to this guy right here. Um, and he should, yeah, there we go. So 28, 28, 28, 28, 28, there we go, not too much. Alright, next regent we need is, uh, Christopher, I believe that is a moose shield, let me go check. Alright, so we need, uh, how many Christopher was, yeah, three, so we need six. So, yeah, I believe this guy does. Yes, he does indeed. Um, six of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, almost done, kind of. Next regent we need, we'll need is, um... Spider Silk. I have no idea where to get that. Let me search it really quick. I'm pretty sure you can get it in the bazaar, though, so hold on. Alright, Spider Silk can be found in the bazaar. There's like 500 available, 25 each. So, you're not, you're not gonna have a problem, um, getting this regent, so it shouldn't be too hard. Alright, next region. Uh, Frost Flower, yes. Um, Frost Flower can actually be found in the bazaar usually. Let's, let's, oh uh, yeah. Um, Frost Flower is in the bazaar right here. Um, so yeah, it shouldn't be too hard, however, um, if you're having bad luck for some reason, I mean, I'm sure there should be some there, but if for some reason there's not, and it takes forever to spawn, then you can go to Grizzleheim, go to Merkholm Keep, and go to that one place where the Grindel is, where the water is near the Banshees. There's like frost flower regents here and just keep on changing realm. Alright, now the next regent. Um Yeah, Black Pearl. I think this one's the hardest one to get on here. Let's check Black Pearl. Yeah, I don't see Black Pearl. Hold on. I think there's another way to get it. Alright, so for the Black Pearl you can go to Mushu. This guy has a uh no 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 not you, my bad. <laughs> Um, this guy, yeah, Toshio, he has a, uh, transmute recipe. Transmute, but okay, we don't want that, obviously. Um, we want the Black Pearl, Black Lotus, either one. So, you know what, I'm gonna buy both of them, actually. Um, so yeah, this, I think this is the easiest way. You can also get Black Pearl from the Rare Harvest from, uh, Black Lotus you find throughout Mushu or wherever. 
Um, I need to, I still need to craft this, like, honestly, but anyway, I'll still get my bed. Uh, yeah, oh, there it is. Transmute, Black Pearl, 15 Black Lotus, and we need, like, how many again? 16, oh my, and I only, so I, I need 15 then, okay. Because I only have one, alright. Um, I'll do that later, let's move on to Stone Block. So, a really good, this is... Um, pretty much the best way to get stone block like way faster than the bazaar. I guarantee when I go back here There is gonna be stone block Okay, apparently somebody took it, but there will be people out here farming stone block because it is one of the most areas um, Where stone block spawn so let's go to pixie realm yeah, Okay, there we go, so Yeah, this is by far one of the best ways to get stone block like, literally, every time you change realm, there's always going to be stone block, like, 90% of the time. If there's not, somebody token. It's also one of the best ways to get ore. So, pretty much, um, the best, one of the best ways to get diamond and, um, and, um, fossils. Because, look how many fossils I have. And I don't even craft fossils. This is how many I have. I only bought, like, four once, but, like, this is how many I have from rare, um, harvests of stone block. Because I always come here, and I always farm for the stone block. Like, watch again. I'll change realm in a minute. Hold on. Alright, here we are. Change realm. See, more stone block. So you can just repeat that over and over. Um, or you can just go to the bazaar, it doesn't really matter. Stone block's not hard to get. And... So yeah, and I'm, I'm already prepared for the Zafaria crafting quest. I've been getting ready for that on this wizard, so yeah. Alright, that's all. Um, anyway, so I'll come back to you guys when I have enough, um black pearls so yeah like i said you may find black pearl in the bazaar sometimes dang it, i don't have enough gold all right so another three spawn in the bazaar so yeah i i guess i prefer um farming the bazaar or just transmitting it those are the easiest ways so yeah all right hey guys i'm back it's like five hours no like eight hours later and i think my crafting timer is reset by now so um but yeah, for the um the black um black pearl usually I just farmed in the bazaar and waited and um transmuted a lot of black lotus to um black pearl. So yeah. Alright, that's one. And another one. Oh you gotta be kidding me. Alright, apparently that was a glitch. For some reason I had to log out, then it would let me craft again, because I mean I already have two available, so yeah, if that happens to you, just log out and it should let you craft again if you have a available crafting slot, so yeah. Alright, there we go. We're almost done, guys. Alright. Let's see what you've got. Balthazar examines your work more carefully than you've ever seen. Well, color me impressed. I've got to say, your skill is definitely notable. Are you sure you're not from Dragon Spire? You should indeed feel proud of your work when it comes to rings and ropes. But are you ready for a real test of your skill? To demonstrate your versatility, you must make for me an item of furniture. Looking around this room, I see it is in need of new bookshelves. Your challenge is to craft two crimson book stacks. Bring them here when you are finished. We will see if you have earned the badge of Master Artisan. You will need a housing crafting station for this challenge. If you do not have one, you can purchase one from vendors throughout the Spiral, including Dragon Spire's own Mesa Lightweight. Alright, so you want to buy the Crimson Book Stand from this guy, obviously. So... Crimson Book Stand. Okay, where is it? Uh... Wait, hey, hold on, did he give it to us? Be right back. Alright, yeah, so you go over here to, um, to get the housing, uh, equipment crafting station. I don't have that, I guess. I just checked. Now, to get the Crimson Book Stand, you have to go to Mushu, so I'll meet you guys over there. Alright, so, over here to this guy again, like we went last time, and I believe he has it. Yep, right here. Um, so, the recipes aren't really hard to get, so, um, I'll meet you guys in the bazaar. Alright, for the first regent we need um, three fire elves, so that'll be six in total, since we're making two. So over here in the bazaar, it's not that hard, um, there should be fire elves here. So 
3D fire elf. Yeah, there we go. Um, which one's the cheapest? Alright. Alright, there we go. Um, that's, uh, like what? 10% done? 20? Um, okay, so six fire. No, need. Yeah, yeah, six. Um, shadow oil. I believe we can get that here. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. Um, yeah, shadow oil. How many do we need? No, not that. No, no. Um, six shadow oil. Alright, so. There we go. Um, two glass vial. I believe we, we can get that in the new shoe, but do they have it here? So the EFG, yes. So two glass vial. You can also get it from the Regent Vendor in Mushu, I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can, you can. Um, cattail. Um, you need a little bit more, but yeah. Um, cattail you can get in the bazaar easily. I think I need like five more, six. There we go. That's enough. Um, three, six, twelve, alright. Well, I think I need one more cat tail. Wait, one more, here we go. Alright, next region, Nightshade. Okay, I skipped it again, my gosh. Um, Nightshade, this one's, um, these three right here are the hardest. I already have enough Blood Moss. You know, let's talk about Blood Moss first. Blood Moss, I will just wait it out in the bazaar, because I see a few spawn every few minutes or so, so... You can also get it as a rare harvest from a, um... Red Mandrake, and let me see if there's a transmute recipe for it. Alright, so a few vendors have the, um, the transmute blood moss, so there is a transmute blood moss recipe. Um, it requires 15 mandrake, and I believe you can get red mandrake from here, I'm not sure if it's always available. Yeah, um, to get red mandrake, you can just, like, farm around the night side and you keep on changing realm, that's what I did. And there is some in Sunken City, however, I, I would just wait it out in the bazaar, um, because blood moss isn't really that hard to find, it spawns every... Every few seconds, at least with my experience, so... Alright, next region. Um... Alright, let's do Nightshade now. Oh my gosh. So we need 24, I only have 7. Nightshade... So obviously, the, pretty much the first method for any region is a bazaar. Um, the second method you can, um... Here, hold on. Alright, so yeah, for Nightshade, um, you can actually use a Transmute Nightshade recipe, which requires 15 Deep Mushroom. And deep mushroom is always in bazaar, like always. It's really cheap, so you shouldn't have trouble with. Um, here it is. Like I'll show you right here. Um, 15 deep mushroom, and you can get it from these guys. I'll just get it from the one in Krakatopia. But um, yeah, and so yeah, it's pretty easy. Just get 15 deep mushroom, um, transmute it, and yeah. Um, hold on. Is there any nightshade right now? Let me check. No, there is not. Okay. Um, final region, which is, um, Black Pearl. So yeah, basically, like I said earlier, transmute on um, Black Lotus. It, it isn't that hard. Um, to keep on changing realms in Mushu. Oh, or I would, I would, I'd rather just, like, farm it out in the Bazaar, actually. I mean, usually I don't like to farm out regions in the Bazaar because it takes a while. But, you know, it's Black Pearl. I mean, I already have enough fossils, and I'm not even in the Safari Crafting Quest, so, like... Fossils, mm, fossil, yeah, 47, and uh, how many stone block? 227, so yeah. So, um, let me know if you guys have any more. Okay, I'm not even done with the video yet, but that's pretty much it. But, um, I'll come back to you guys tomorrow since I don't have any, um, crafting slots right now. Only one and we need two, so, uh, see you guys tomorrow. Alright, hey guys, welcome back. Um, yeah, it's the next day, it's October 10. Now, for the Black Pro, I just camped that out in the bazaar, and if you're having trouble with Nightshade, I recommend just transmuting it with 15 Deep Mushroom, because that costs about 400 gold around there, whereas Nightshade only costs, like, for one, 1,000, so you're saving, like, 600 gold, but anyway, um, okay, that's the equipment, we need, yeah, yeah, equipment, um, no, we need the housing, oh, I need to buy that, hold on, okay, no, I, I do have it, I, yeah, I bought it earlier, I forgot, um, Come on, there we go. Um, I seriously need to buy a castle. I'm too lazy to, honestly. Um, so there's one. 
All right, and numero dos. Yes, we're done with Dragon Spire. And if, once I get Celestia done, I can finally get that Winter Tusk Grove. All right, guys, meet you over there. And now, it's time for judgment. Balthazar examines each of your bookshelves, paying close attention to the tiniest of details. Very well. My judgment is that today, young wizard, you have earned the badge of Master Artisan. Congratulations. Yes. All right, wait. What? Master Artist. Oh. Time for you to continue. Okay, then. <laughs> Don't find me in here. No. We'll do that another time. Um, alright guys, thank you for watching. Let me know if you have any more questions about this quest. It's not really that hard. I say the Black Pearl is the hardest. Nightshade isn't really that hard. Just transmute a lot of Deep Mushroom, like I said. You save like 600 to go doing that way instead of camping it out in the bazaar. Which is not a bad thing to do. I mean, I see like two spawn every five minutes or so, but yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching, and bye.